the blogs you read on the internet and even the news you read on the internet and especially the opinions on the internet are not actually sincere well-informed opinions they are propaganda of hired writers who are saying what they're paid to write these are not experts these are hired writers writing what they are paid to write I'm a private American citizen not even involved in politics I'm primarily concerned with Iran's nuclear weapons program in view of the fact that they sponsor terrorism I'm concerned that they could hand over a nuclear device to a small group of unnamed terrorists who could bring such a device into the United States and detonate it they could use the bomb for blackmail or to actually kill a large number of Americans what I've run up against is politics it seems that a leftist so-called progressive they don't call themselves leftist or socialist or communist appears to be heavily influencing the Democratic Party many of you have heard of George Soros who has strange ideas about politics I haven't figured him out yet but uh, he it's obvious that he opposes George Bush and probably opposes any Republican and he's funding heavily the Democrat Party and the Democrat Party is very much involved on the internet with their websites moveon.org vote vets and something about get out of Iran they have dozens of groups on the internet or primarily on the internet or connected to the internet which get funds from foundations which in turn are funded by other foundations which ultimately are funded by donations from a few wealthy liberal people I would hazard, hazard a guess that many of the writers on the internet who are saying that we have no good military options in Iran we must withdraw from the Middle East I doubt that they even know what Natanz is these are not experts that are providing information and news and opinion on the internet these are not experts these are hired writers writing what they are paid to write